Hey yo guys, it's me, I'm Sarka. welcome to Last Dinner Survival. So before we start talking about drills, oil pumps and all other stuff, let's go, let's do this rest up event super quickly because it's gonna disappear in two minutes and I don't want it to disappear, guys. Finally, I got a different rest up event because I kept getting the same rest up event all the time. So let's go, let's pop these survivors pretty damn quickly. Why am I shooting those foxes, deers, whatever you want to call them? Here we go, one... Why the frick there is only one guy left? Here we go, guys. They're all dead. Let's go. Let's pick up their loot. So finally, we're done with this rest stop event. Well, this guy is lying in a very comfy position, I would say. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Gonna loot their choppers and probably we're gonna get some cool thick goons. Oh my goodness. We got a zip gun. Oh, and we got a full durability, almost M16. That's very nice. Plus five copper bars. That's very, very appreciated. That's a lot of deer, guys. So, guys, I'm finally done with that rest up event. And look at this drill machine. First of all, I had no clue where could it be. But then, but then after rewatching that yesterday's clip for quite some time, I found out that that drill was actually featured in that clip in the first half a second or something like that. Here we go. There's the screenshot of yesterday's clip. And you can see on the right side, there is that drill machine standing over there. So, it's going to be, guys, in the clan lobby. It's going to be around sector 7. And I have no clue where it's gonna be but we see that in drill machine we'll have to put fuel inside and uh, that there are some sort of parts i have no idea and there is also durability in that drill machine i have no clue what we're gonna be doing with the drill machine but it looks like maybe it will be somewhere in the pump jack maybe that's what we're gonna be doing maybe we're gonna be drilling oil with that drill machine or maybe drill machine is gonna have a bit different things but i'm pretty sure guys i'm almost 99 sure that we it's going to be beyond sector 7 and i am almost sure that that drill machine is gonna come very very soon because clan and lobby is coming out probably next week because they already teased us with this coming soon and other stuff so maybe next week by the end of next week or maybe in the beginning of the next week we're gonna get that update guys i have no clue when it's gonna come out and uh we're gonna be able to have our clan lobby and in that clan lobby we're gonna have that drill machine and still it's not known what we're gonna do but maybe maybe look at that guys it says available only during clan wars so maybe it's not going to be a pump jack because we will need to do clan wars here in order to go to the pump jack or maybe we will be able to go there and drill oil with that drill or maybe we'll be able to drill other resources with it or maybe it's completely different purpose i have no idea guys leave your thoughts and comments down below what we're gonna be able to do with that drill machine but right now we're gonna go and we will start doing farm because i want to get that blueprint and after the farm guys we're gonna go to the police station because my police station is reset and i still have a bunch of cards to open up maybe we're gonna do a couple of waves because i do want to get enough blue cards to open up a purple chest because i still haven't opened up a purple chest in the police department but here i'm just hunting for my cleaver handle because if i get my cleaver handle i'm gonna get my favorite weapon and i will probably keep grinding with that weapon all the time so let's go let's guys do this uh farm pretty pretty damn quickly it's not that hard to do it doesn't even require that many resources before i was usually lazy to do that farm but now i realize that it's better to do it every day every two days i mean because i want to get my thingy well i can't even uh, sneak anymore god damn it so we're gonna check the left side for that blue box maybe the blue box is somewhere over here nope guys the blue box is not over here and bunch of dudes have just spawned i will also check now quickly the right side as well as there is a lot of dudes anyways uh okie dokie the blue box is over here guys on the right side so now we know it now i just have to survive somehow because there is a lot of zombies and they will totally destroy me where they all disappeared like literally just like that boom and they all disappeared so i will most likely need to use here guys a lot of melee and a lot of goons as well because that infected Wolfie is going to literally, guys, destroy me. So that's it. Finally, we located that box. We already took it. So it was probably one of the easiest locations that it could be. Usually, it's somewhere on the top. And there, you have to find more peeps. But here, it was pretty easy. Peasy lemon squeezy. We also have to fight now our revenger. Revenger. Whatever you want to call him. I'm pretty sure he's going to drop me bones. Because he haven't dropped me bones for quite some time, guys. And something tells me that we're going to get bones from him today. Oops, he's got spit it on. Just like always. Oh my goodness, got spit it twice. Are you kidding me? Bro, this is not even funny anymore, guys. I lost my full set. I literally had full durability set here. And I just lost it. And guess what, guys? I again forgot my iron hatchet. Isn't that Gucci? Here we go, give me bones, brother. Here we go. Like I said, guys, we're gonna get bones. But sorry, how did you know? It's just skills, guys. That's what I call skills. Knowing what you're gonna get from Revenger is skills. So right now, guys, I'll go back to the base to go get some probably iron hatchets and I'll come back. So see you guys in three, two, one. So skitty peep, skitty pop, ladies and gentlemen. I'm back at the farm. I'm gonna go equip that stuff and finally I will open up that 
Thingy, you got the point. But first of all, let's go. Let's fight with that rat and yokel. You know what? We just aggroed the bull. I'm too lazy to exit the area. So we're just gonna pop him. Haven't killed bulls in a really, really long time. And they dropped nothing. Literally, guys, wish that they dropped something. It's very, very sad. That bulls don't drop anything. I, for my, In my opinion, guys, this is Despacito. If you don't think that this is Despacito, then I don't know, guys. But this is so sad. Bulls should be dropping something. I don't know. Bones, horns, anything. Everything is better than nothing. Whatever. Let's go. Let's eat. Let's chop down this uh, door. And let's go. Let's get my cleaver handle blueprint. If I'm gonna get it, guys, I'll go nuts. I will seriously start jumping from happiness because this is the only thing that I wanna get. I think after that, I will stop even doing farm because I won't need to do the farm at all. Whatever, let's go. Let's check it out. Well, we got a red ticket. We got some dog food. Well, I would say this is definitely, guys, better than nothing. But that's still not enough for me. I need more. Gonna kill a couple of rat and yokel so that I don't have to fight with them after. Let's activate sprint skill once again. And let's go. Let's play that blue box into the metal cutter and let's hope that we're gonna get something great my goodness guys i'm so sad after so many great openings here i still haven't gotten a proper blueprint because i keep getting the same like spear or bow blueprints i don't even understand why did they add them to the game like bow blueprints are just trash no one uses bow spear blueprints are trash everything half of the blueprints here in the game are trash why did they add them <laughs> I'm just sad, guys. Literally, very, very sad about it. Whatever. Let's go. Let's place it in shoot. And let's check it out. What we're gonna get, brother. Okay, two infected wolves are coming. So, I will try to pop them as quick as possible. Wow, that's a lot of them, guys. And look at that. I don't really have a lot of healing items. So, I will try to use as many Glock bullets as possible. So, here we go, guys. Somehow, some way, I survived with that little health. So, I won't even need anything else. Haha, <laughs> suckers. So, I'm gonna get out of here. And I will go and open up that blue blueprint by dodging all of those savage giants. I will also open up this sack because we might get something noise inside of it. Like, five shrooms, for example, guys. Five shrooms is always appreciated. Am I right? <laughs> Let's go, let's open up this sack as well. Maybe, maybe, guys, we're gonna get a blueprint over here. But I don't think you can find blueprints here. Nope, but we did get, guys, one aluminum bar. And aluminum bars are really appreciated. Whatever, let's go, let's destroy these dudes. Here we go, these are all the savage giants. Am I right? Did I aggro all of them? So here we go, savage giants over here. Let's just go to the top, baby. And let's open up. And let's see what we're gonna get in showed. Okay, dokie, so this is what we got. Oh my goodness. Let's pick it up. There's nothing else that I can take, guys. That's it. Well, I'll also have to open up the farm doors or whatever. That's it. Or whatever that is. So we got, guys, a saw blade maze blueprint. What is it? A heavy handle, guys. I already have it. Like I said, they keep giving me these common blueprints at the farm. So sometimes I keep... I start questioning myself. Is it really worth it to go to the farm, guys? Because I don't... Magazines are great. But again, I got the same magazine that I had before. So uh, this magazine literally gives me nothing. This is just sad and disappointing. That's what I have to tell you guys. Look at those savage giants, guys. What the freak is going on? Oof, that's a little bit scary. Probably we're gonna get guys another gas tank. Still haven't gotten a gas tank at the farm, but I've heard a lot of people getting gas tanks here, so I know that it's totally possible. Whatever, let's go. Let's open up the chopper then. And let's see what we're gonna get. Well, aluminum nails, and I'm out of here. I'm out of here, baby. So that's it, peeps. This is the loot that I got at the farm. I mean, we got some dog food, but I don't even care about it. It is pretty rare, but what's the point of the dog food? I already have true friend doggy, so it doesn't do anything. Wish I had. Wish I got at least one purple blueprint, but we got just one common blueprint. So whatever, guys. Now we're gonna go to the police department because, like, as you can see, it's reset. Also, I'm hoping for a revenge raid because we might get it, but I have no clue. We might also not get it, but it would be dope to do our revenge raid. So this was a zombie horde. Here we go. Go. Gonna let my poopies go. Sophie and Joey. Very nice. Sophie and Joey. Be nice. So I'm back at the base and I decided that we will go to the police department. So I took a couple of guns. That's not a lot of weapons, guys. But that should be enough at least for a little bit. So I'm gonna clear like maybe 20 waves or something. And maybe we're gonna get a little bit of blue cards. Because I can't wait, guys, to get those 10 cards. And then we're gonna open up a purple crate. Just for the memes. Just for the lols. Even though I feel like opening up 10 crates would be more worth it. We're still gonna think about this, right? I will definitely think about it. But... As of right now, we still gotta go and grind. I will open up maybe five green or maybe we'll open up a few blue. I don't know, but most likely, guys, we'll open up five green. And I will also grind a little bit with milk, with my milk core. And I keep getting comments sometimes from random people like, what is milk core? For those who don't know, milk core is a grenade launcher. So that's very nice. Well, what's up, what's up, what's up, dealer buddy? Very nice. So I think we will start doing the police department like right now. There is no need even to wait for it. I will just go, I'll, cup, I'll pop a couple of dudes. 
It's pretty easy. And we're gonna start our wave. Hopefully, I took everything. That's just what I'm hoping for. My doggies are fed. Everything is nice. Gonna leave here another set. I do have a couple of dolls. Gonna take this off right now, guys. And that's it. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. I think we're ready to start. I have a couple of guns. So let's go, guys. Let's activate the first wave. And we're gonna grind. Like, maybe we're gonna do, like, 20 waves or something. Maybe hopefully we're gonna get at least one or two blue cards. Well, already one brown badge from him. Isn't that amazing? Here we go, baby. Third wave. And after this wave, probably I will start using weapons as there will be too many zombies. And I don't want to waste all of my subblade maces on these dudes. I kept them for those riot shielded zombies. Here we go. Fourth wave, baby. Here we go. Another brown badge. And probably this is going to be brown. Of course, this is another brown. Whatever, guys. Let's go. Let's pee pee. And I will now most likely equip my shoes and do the fifth wave. Maybe at sixth or seventh wave, I will start using my milkor. Again, I'm scared to use my milkor because I know that I might fail. Most of the time, I... I don't usually fail Milkor, but sometimes Brawler hits me too quickly and then I just die like last time. So it is a bit dangerous, but it's still usually very, very fun, guys, to use that Milkor at the police department. Whatever, here we go, they died. Another brown. Show me what I got. Uh, another brown and probably most likely, of course, another brown. Yes, of course, brother. Of course, what else would I get here? Here we go, this wave is cleared once again, but they dropped nothing, so that's a little bit sad. So I will equip my set, guys. Let's go, let's try out my Milkor. We're going to see what we're going to get and show it, guys. A little bit scared, but you know what? Everything will be fine. We will survive. Let's go. Let's activate the sprint skill. He already has his shield up. That's a little bit sad. Hopefully, he won't. Here we go. He put it down. Let's go. Let's attack it. Healed. Nice. So far, guys, easy peasy lemon squeezy doing it like a boss. A brown badge, a brown badge, and of course, guys, 100% another brown. Already, guys, 10 brown, zero green, zero blue. A little bit sad. Here we go, 8th wave, baby. Here we go, we cleared, guys, this, another wave. There for dice. Brown. Brown, guys, keep getting brown every day. Let's go for the ninth wave now. Gonna go in circle again, gonna wait until he will put up his shield. I mean, put it back, I mean, whatever, you got the point what I'm trying to say. He still keeps... Here we go. Somehow, some way, guys, we survived that. That's highly appreciated. Let's go. Let's take my saw blade mace and let's pop that right shielded zombie. Most likely, my doggo. Yes, my doggo got tired. So I'll have to do it by my own. Thank you, doggo. And there are two cards, and those were double brown. Here we go. Tenth wave, brother. Here we go. Cleared, guys, the tenth wave once again. Oh my goodness, we got one! Two blue, double blue, baby. We got double blue, and I feel like it is would that would be the perfect time to stop because I don't think we're gonna get guys a third blue card. Am I right? I mean, we almost used nothing, but I got zero green. That's the the sad part. I would love to get a couple of green cards as well, not only blue, because it's not only all about blue, guys. So we're gonna go. We're probably gonna use that milk core completely, but as you see, it's totally possible to get blue cards. It's not the first time when I get that many blue cards. Here we go. Survived. Popped. All of them are dead. Dead. We got one green. Finally, we got one green. We'd love to get five green uh, with using this full milk warble plural, but probably we're not gonna get it. Here we go. There's double riot shielded zombies, so I have to make sure that they both don't have their shield up. Okay, felt to to kill the explosive zombie, but he's dead now. So here I cleared this wave once again. Brown tickets. So far, brown and zero green. That's a little bit sad, guys. I'm already now grinding here only for green tickets because green tickets are OP. Let's go. Gonna do a circle. Here we go. Attack them. Yield them. And everyone's dead. That's it. Easy peasy. This wave was cleared in like a couple of seconds. And we got nothing but brown. Oh, here we go, baby. 14th wave. Another riot shielded. Here we go, they're all dead once again. What I got, brown, brown, brown. Wow, this it doesn't matter that I got blue cards, guys. Where are my green cards? Here we go, this wave is cleared as well. Brown, 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 brown. Wow, are you kidding me? Here we go, this wave is clear. Uh, finally, we got at least another green, guys. That's better than nothing. And a bunch of brown. Are you kidding me? Well, that is going to be three green. So that's nice. But I still want to, guys, use my core completely. Let's go. Let's use it, guys, into tiny little pieces. Okay, 17th wave should be easy. Peasy. Lemon squeeze, eh? 
Here goes 17 wave is clean, two cards, and guess what? Double brown, baby. It's sad. It's it's a meme at this point. Alright, let's go, baby. 18th wave now. Gonna activate the sprint skill. A little bit of roaming around. The tag, heal. And uh, here we go. Well, let's check it out. What we got? Well, finally, one green. More brown. Just, ah, and nothing else. Whatever, so this is going to be a 19th wave. That's nice. Let's go. Let's do the 19th wave, baby. Here go. 19th wave was done in like one second. We got double green, and that's very, very, very nice and appreciate it. I still want to go and use my milk or play. That's going to be enough for one or two shots. So this is most likely going to be the last wave that we do. Here go. Let's heal up. Attack, heal. Here go. Milk is broken, guys. And let's see what we got. Green. Brown, 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 brown. Well, we got, guys, bunch of brown, but that doesn't matter that we didn't get any blue. I love that we got blue. Let's go. Let's surrender now. At least this is how I think that it's the most efficient way to get cards. Oh, plus we got a Selkie. I'm definitely going to be keeping these Selkies because someone told me that you have to save up five Selkies or something and then you will be able to uh, get that tank top. And I mean, why not? Let's try to get that tank top. So I think I have two or three Selkies at the home. At home, so we're going to just get away. But now, right now, guys, let's open up five green. And uh, we got two blue. So I still, guys, need one more blue for the purple. That's very nice. Let's go. Let's insert five green, baby. Here we go. They're done. My SWAT set is completely broken, so we're not going to be taking it. Well, what I got, guys, one shotgun already and shotgun blueprint. Uh, pipe and VSS blueprint. Another Glock blueprint. Uh, saw blade mace. And another blueprint that we already have for our Winchester blueprint. Well, whatever. This is the loot that we got. That's not that great, but totally not that bad as well. For the guns that I used, it was great. Plus, guys, look at all the loot. All the other cars that I'll be able to get. Like, I have a bunch of brown, right? I will exchange all those brown for green. Plus, I have more brown at the base. And I still have a bunch of green cards. And with those green cards, I'm going to get a lot of weapons. And uh, it's just Gucci. Like, what I have to say, guys... Police department is really, really great. If you have milk ores, then you're going to get rich here in no time. So I would suggest you guys getting your milk ores and doing police department with milk ores because they save up a tremendous amount of weapons. And with one or two milk ores, you can do, you can get a lot of cards here. If you don't exchange your green for blue, you're going to get rich quickly. So yeah, guys, as you can see, we have nine green cards a little bit more and we'll open up that purple one so highly suggested checking out my seven days to die let's play just click here on the first card and you'll go straight away there or click here on the second card to watch another epic last dinner survival raid and i'm uploading such videos on youtube every single day so make sure to drop that subscribe button and notification bell to not miss any future videos guys and also drop that like button while we're at it and peace 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 out uh-huh